welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the exciting world of cinema. Buckle up, because March is bringing some fantastic films to the big screen. Let's jump right in. Don't forget to like the video. My thing has the real control of it. We're venturing into the sand-swept universe of Dune. If you haven't seen the first installment, go grab your spice melange and catch up, because Dune Part 2 is about to blow our minds. Story, Paul Atriides unites with Chani and the Freeman while on a warpath of revenge against the conspirators who destroyed his family. Facing a choice between the love of his life and the fate of the known universe, he endeavors to prevent a terrible future only he can foresee. I am Poe. We're venturing into the animated realm of Kung Fu Panda. If you haven't seen the previous installments, grab your dumplings and catch up, because Kung Fu Panda 4 is about to deliver a high-kicking adventure. Story Play is gearing up to become the spiritual leader of his Valley of Peace, but also needs someone to take his place as Dragon Warrior. As such, he will train a new Kung Fu practitioner for the spot and will encounter a villain called the Chameleon who conjures villains from the past. Imaginary is an upcoming American supernatural horror film directed and produced by Jeff Wadlow. The screenplay was co-written by Wadlow, Greg Erb, and Jason Ormland. The film features a talented cast, including The story unfolds when Jessica returns to her childhood home with her family. There, she discovers her old stuffed bear, Chauncey, and notices that her youngest stepdaughter, Alice, has grown attached to it. As Alice's behavior becomes increasingly concerning, and the games she plays with Chauncey take a sinister turn, Jessica realizes that Chauncey yeah, is much more than the innocent stuffed bear she believed him to be all those years. Alice? Cabrini is an upcoming American biographical drama film directed by Alejandro Gomez Monteverdi and written by Rod Barr, based on a story by both. Story, from Alejandro Monteverdi, award-winning director of Sound of Freedom, comes the powerful epic of Francesca Cabrini, an Italian immigrant who arrives in New York City in 1889 and is greeted by disease, crime, and impoverished children. Cabrini sets off on a daring mission to convince the hostile mayor to secure housing and healthcare for society's most vulnerable. With broken English and poor health, Cabrini uses her entrepreneurial mind to build an empire of hope unlike anything the world had ever seen. The film is based on the 1999 novel of the same name by Cole Thompson. Set in the heart of Texas, it weaves a tale of quirky characters, unexpected friendships, and a dash of eccentricity. In the small town of Bartlett, where tumbleweeds gossip and secrets bloom like wildflowers, Merle Lusky stumbles upon an unusual discovery, a box of chocolate lizards. These whimsical treats hold more than sweetness, they harbor memories, dreams, and a touch of magic. As Merle shares these confections with his neighbors, their lives intertwine in delightful and unexpected ways. From Faye's flower shop to Irwin's dusty bookstore, the chocolate lizards become a catalyst for love, redemption, and laughter. The American Society of Magical Negroes is a 2024 American satirical fantasy comedy film written, directed, and co-produced by Kobe Libiai. Story, a young man, Aaron, is recruited into a secret society of magical black people who dedicate their lives to a cause of utmost importance making white people's lives easier. That's why we fight white discomfort and... Arthur the King is an upcoming American adventure on, film directed by Simon Selen Jones, 
written know. by Michael Brandt and starring there. Mark Wahlberg, Simu so Liu, and Juliet Rylance. So uh -huh. The People? film is based on the 2016 like nonfiction book titled Arthur, the Dog Who Crossed the Jungle to Find a Home by Michael Lindor. The story revolves around the captain of an adventure racing team who befriends a wounded stray dog named Arthur. Together, they embark on a grueling 435-mile endurance race through Ecuador. Ghostbusters, Frozen Empire is an upcoming American supernatural comedy film directed by Gil Keenan, who co-wrote it with Jason Reitman. It serves as the sequel to Ghostbusters, Afterlife, 2021, and is the fifth installment in the Ghostbusters franchise. Story, years after preventing a dimensional crossrip in Somerville, Oklahoma, the seasoned Ghostbusters reunite with their new recruits. Together, they must save New York City from a formidable First adversary capable history, of plunging the world into a second first. ice age. The discovery of an ancient artifact sets the stage for this chilling battle. Your own tear gas, freezing up. Luca is an upcoming American supernatural comedy film produced by Pixar Animation Studios and distributed by Walt Disney Studios Motion Pictures. The film is a computer animated fantasy comedy that explores the coming of age journey of a young boy during an unforgettable summer on the Italian Riviera. Story, a young boy experiences an unforgettable seaside summer on the Italian Riviera filled with gelato, pasta, and endless scooter rides. Luca shares these adventures with his newfound best friend, but all the fun is threatened by a deeply held secret. He is a sea monster from another world just below the ocean surface. Knox Goes Away is a 2023 American thriller film directed by Michael Keaton and written by Gregory Poirier. The movie features an ensemble cast including Al Pacino, Michael Keaton, James Marsden, Marcia Gay Harden, and more. Plot When a contract killer is diagnosed with a rapidly evolving form of dementia, he is presented with the opportunity to redeem himself by saving the life of his estranged adult son. To do this, he must race against the police closing in on him, as well as the ticking clock of his own rapidly deteriorating man. Actually, in the market for a house of my own in the region here. <laughs> I found her. She's here. Make it messy, Peter. Hope for that, I'm a fallen soul. To keep him from. Lo siento, señora Fuentes, pero inmigración decidió no considerar aplicación. I'm late, I'm so late. I don't... Oh, this menu. What is it with walnuts? Walnuts, walnuts, walnuts. It's like a cafe for squirrels. Walnuts, they go very nicely with the salad. Do I look like I need educating on fine cuisine? <laughs>